morning guys and happy December 8th vlogmas day 8 it's officially been a week I figured out the math don't worry I can't believe it's been a week and I haven't like missed a day yeah they all haven't been great but I I haven't missed a day that's pretty good for me anyways because I I have commitment issues <laughs> Woo! look at this anyways I swear I have other shirts and this i'm gonna change okay it's like 11 40 i woke up kind of late today can we talk about yesterday though i uploaded half of a vlog like i don't even know how that happened but it cut off perfectly i said that's the end of that or something it just like cut off like the rest wasn't there what am i doing <laughs> i really don't know how that happened but i re-uploaded it i really don't know what i'm gonna do today though i know i have to take an online test sometime today for my psychology class um i might go shopping I might film, but mm, I don't want to, I want to film Christmas videos and the Christmas videos, I need stuff for them. I don't want to spend money, so like, we'll see how today goes. So it's like 1.45 now. I've literally been laying in bed just watching YouTube for a couple hours because I feel like I'm getting sick. I changed from one hoodie that I wear every day to another one that I wear every day. But now I think I'm just going to get myself ready for the day. Well, now that that's done, I kind of just want to lay down again. I have this every day, bro, stuck in my head, and it's just, it's tragic. So, I need to work on my Christmas list, because I gave my dad a bunch of, like, gift card ideas, but I guess I need to give him more real present ideas. I know a couple things. Does anyone else make, like, one long Christmas list and then just gives a couple ideas to one person, a couple to another, and a couple to another? Because I always do that. Because, for example, my dad is less likely to get me, like, a wrestling shirt than my brother you know what i mean so i might as well just not even put that on his list <laughs> speaking of wrestling shirts tickets for smackdown and indie in march go on sale today like i want to go and i know my brother would want to go but the thing is like we just went to raw in october which by the way was literally like the best experience of my life we got to witness the shield reuniting so i know my brother will want to go and like he's he's the driver i don't like driving on highways i know he'll want to go but i don't know if he'll actually want to physically go if that makes sense well he personally he went to a pay-per-view on sunday night and then raw on monday night when we went to raw but it is like WrestleMania season. I feel as if though, <laughs> the Bella Twins will be around and I also feel as if though they would be on SmackDown. Really, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just trying to decide if I should bring it up to him. I'm sure he already knows. When we were at Raw and Andy, they announced it, but I'm not sure. I'm also kind of waiting to see if they're gonna come to Fort Wayne soon for a live event. If that's the case, I would definitely rather go to the live event because it's like five minutes away versus two hours away. Guys, Frankie has the hiccups. You okay, Frankie? Oh, buddy, are you okay? You need me to scare you to get rid of them? I feel your pain, boy. I get the worst hiccups. So this vlog is all over the place because I haven't done anything today. So I think I'm going to like clean the house. I don't know. I'm just kind of in the mood. And since we've been decorating this past week, we kind of have stuff everywhere. So it's pretty messy. So now would be... A great time to clean it. There's some stuff that I just genuinely do not know where to put. But check out this cookie jar train. I love it so much. We're about to form the gingerbread house because we have to 
put the walls and stuff together and then it has to sit for three to four hours so we can't actually decorate it till tomorrow it's not i think in did y'all hear that <laughs> <laughs> i don't know i was it was in the distant like background that's why whoa it smells like graham graham crackers Graham crackers. You wouldn't know because you don't watch Care Park 2, but that's because you are the wrong generation and you think it's boring. But you're wrong, but you've never seen it, so you don't know. Look at the gingerbread. Oh my God. Look, at the, look at the tree and the thing. Oh my God, I want to eat all this crap. That's the mm -hmm. hard part. Like, you just want to eat it. Before you even begin to assemble your house, check all the panels. As, as with any baked product, sometimes there might be a slight, a slight shape variations in the cookie panels. Look over all the panels to be sure the edges are straight. Mm -hmm. Get away from my gingerbread house! <laughs> These are the fronts. Are you sure? And back. Yeah. We should have got a pre built one. I thought this came pre built. Turned off. Oh. oh no! <laughs> we'll glue it. It's fine. Yeah. We'll glue it. We're not fit for this. We need to turn this off. Guys, always get a pre assembled gingerbread house. Goes like we're making progress. She's a little we, snowed on. <laughs> we, I made one time and the roof kept falling off. Mm -hmm. So I took the roof off and, and like used this to make rooms inside. And oh my god, it was supposed to be like that. So we're waiting for the gingerbread house to dry. And me and Vanessa have this interesting cupcake deal. She's weird, no offense. And she doesn't like the frosting on cupcakes. So she's gonna give me her frosting and just eat the cake. Nice. A lot of people like will only eat the frosting off the cupcakes, but you will only eat the cake. Yeah. That's weird. The buttercream frosting is gross to me. You're entitled to your wrong opinion. Both of these That's fine. Me. So now your girl gets a cupcake and frosting. And we're going to watch Total Divas. All right, so change of plans because my little sister fell asleep. We're going to have to do the gingerbread house tomorrow. But yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.